what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back we are here for another couple episodes of slam dunk tim seems to be quickening i would say things seem to be warming up a little bit getting out of that slow start that we had with this anime it seems like things are going we're going to get to see this practice match and as i said it kind of reminds me of haikyuu and haikyuu had that first practice match they had against Seijo with one of the top four schools in the prefecture. And I think it's the same thing going on here, right? So, I've said a lot, and I'm not backing down from what I said. I said what I had to say, and that's what it is. <laughs> you can say what you have to say too. Just leave it in the comment section, of course. Let's not waste any more time here as I know, probably all of you have already clicked on the link to go watch the reaction. So, let's jump in. I will see you guys for the review. Okay, so finally, we're here. Finally. Finally, the anime began. The anime, <laughs> I felt like the anime just started, <laughs> to be honest. You know, I felt like I felt like we just now. What the hell is that? I felt like the anime just started. That's just my opinion. Um, but overall, I think, you know, what I'm saying it was a slow start. But we are here now. We're in the middle of a match, a practice match, and we can see how formidable. That other team is, you know what I'm saying? You can't have a slow start again against them. You know what I'm saying? Like, but the engines are hot now. For Shoko. Sho Shoko. I, I don't I don't know how to say it there. I think it's Shoko. Shoko. Whatever. <laughs> whatever the name of the school is. But in any case. Um, they're doing a very good job of portraying certain things in this anime about basketball that I'm really liking to see them in an actual game see the training begin see them in this practice game it just goes to show you um that it doesn't matter if the animation is good or not it's just how it's being portrayed is done in a very selective manner where you know if you compare it between you know a, a basketball game in real life it will hold up you know what i mean so i don't have no qualms there you know what i'm saying no, no no nothing towards that right so i'm really seeing the development here as i said in my last reaction is that i don't think i really don't think that he was going to start and it turns out he didn't because it wouldn't have made sense for him to start he's the literally the beginner of beginners you know what i'm saying like he he's like straight up haven't been playing basketball for a week yet i don't think so <laughs> you know so it's like putting him on the court is just gonna be detrimental even though he really wants to get in there and play i think he the, the coach is probably gonna sub him in somewhere close to the end of the game you know i think the coach did a very good job to calm him down tell him blow some smoke up his ass get it get his ass to sit down telling him oh you're a secret weapon bro you're that good so we're just gonna you know if we're in trouble we'll put you in you know what i'm saying <laughs> when we all know it doesn't work like that in sports right you always want to get your best players to start in basketball um if they're not injured you always want to have your best players on the floor if there's an adjustment needs to need to be made because of a particular team that you're playing maybe this player maybe this player that's on the bench can guard a certain player better or they have better defense you know what i'm saying and maybe they're you know maybe they um the other team doesn't have a, a matchup for that player and they do better against them then you can play that player and start that player but he's not in that position for you to even say that he's basically um a rookie with with no skill you know what i'm saying like he took forever to learn how to do a layup which is like 
you know, already I've spoken enough about that. <laughs> you know, and him out here calling himself a genius. He can't even make a layup. That was kind of funny. But, um, yeah, I like it, man. I like how they get fired up. And, you know, when a team comes out and slaps you in the mouth and be like, hey, bro, we here to play. You know what I'm saying? So I'm glad that Akagi and Rukawa has really woken up to start playing now. And they brought the lead down to eight from all the way from, um, they were down 19 at the beginning of the game, couldn't score. So for them to be able to bring it within eight, that's pretty good. It gives them a pretty, a better chance of coming back and winning the game. So shout out to them, of course. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for tuning in. As always, man, that is it for me in this review for these two episodes. Of course, I like it. I love it. I love it. It's revving up my engine now. And... I need to get into the sports of the sports anime. You know what I'm saying? Like, um, so I'm loving that. So don't forget to like the video. Don't forget to comment. And your boy will catch you later, man. Peace.